Here I have Tecno smartphone and let me show you how to take screenshots on this device. Let me show you all screenshot methods and also let me show you some cool tricks that you can use to save the screen. Let's begin. All right, so let's start with the quickest and the simplest way to take a screenshot. All you need to do is use this combination of keys, power key and volume down. Let's hold down together those two keys like for about one second and as you can see you just save the screenshot let me show you again power key and volume down together and you can also drag and catch the screen here in that corner and if this is not the screen that you would like to save you can drag it here to the bottom and to the center of the screen and simply remove the screenshot let me show you again power key and volume down together catch the screen and remove it. If you would like to save it, you don't need to do anything. Let's just wait, the screenshot will automatically uh, save in the AI gallery. Okay, now let's go to the next simple trick and simple way to take a screenshot. All you need to do is swipe here and find the screenshot icon. Let's just tap it and you just save the screenshot. Let me show you again swipe here tap the screenshot icon and you just save the screenshot all right you can also do some other things with your screenshots for example let's just swipe and here you should see this arrow this small arrow next to the screenshot let me just tap it and here you can also choose the screenshot but you can also choose the partial screenshot or scrolling screenshot Choose the partial screenshot, so now you can choose the area that you would like to save. For example, this part of the screen is that this is the thing that I would like to save. So I can choose this arrow here. I can also reset the area and do it again. Here you can also choose edit and share if you would like to. But in my case, this is the thing that I would like to save, so let's just tap it. Okay, let's do it again here to screenshot. Let's use this arrow. And as you can see, you can also choose the scrolling screenshot. So let's just tap it. And now the device is saving the long screenshot. So for example, you've got the whole list of applications that you would like to save. You can use this scrolling screenshot and you will save the whole list. Tap done. Here you can see your huge uh, screen, your hu huge screenshot. You can also edit this screenshot here, you can mark something here, you can choose for example some arrows and do some other corrections and editing. Uh, you may for example put some text here. Basically you can do a lot of stuff here. If you would like to share the screen, let's just use this button. If you would like to delete it, use the following icon and to save it, use the icon in the top right corner okay as you can see you can also have a quick access to the settings with the screenshots let me do it again one second okay here let's choose this arrow more settings and let's just make sure that you've got enabled those cool features. Let's enable the full screen capture, partial screenshot and delete after editing. If you have those three things enabled, let me show you how they work. Let's tap settings and here you can use three fingers to swipe down and to take the long screenshot to take the scrolling screenshot. Let me show you three fingers, swipe down, use this arrow here. Let me show you again. And as you can see, if you use this arrow here, you will save the whole list of settings. So it's really easy to save the whole list of settings to save the long screenshot, tap done. This is the screenshot, let me save it. You can also use the partial screenshot by using three fingers. Let's just touch the screen together with the three fingers and you will save it. 
you need to do it together. Okay, and you can drag some area here to save the part of the screen. Okay, let me tap save. And that's it. To get access to your screenshot, you can use the AI gallery and here you can have access to your screenshot so here you can also delete them edit or do some other stuff you can choose either photos here to see the recent fo recent photos or albums and choose the desired folder so the screenshot okay of course besides screenshot you can also record screen so if you use this tools here and use this arrow you can choose screen recorder and record the screen you can check out how to do it on our other videos so thank you for watching please subscribe to our channel and leave thumbs up under the video